How's the adjustment to basketball here at Baton Rouge? Uh, well, that's a good question. I think it's been pretty smooth for me. Uh, Coach Carey definitely coaches a lot different than um, previous head coach Linda Lappy. Uh, and at first, I kind of just tried to laugh him off because he's, you know, he's a funny person in general. Uh, but now I'm kind of used to it. You know, it's him yelling, and I kind of expect it, so it's not a shock. She should be more worried when you stop yelling. Uh, yes, as any coach, when they stop talking to you, you know you did something really bad. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about how how you came to choose WVU, how that process went. Okay, let's see how I can make this a short process. Um, it was actually kind of a tough one um, between. I had it kind of down to Purdue, uh, Michigan State here, and I think. Michigan State came along um, a lot later than everybody else, um, and with Coach Carey and the rest of the staff here, I kind of already had a, a really solid bond with them, and I really, I don't know, I just enjoy their presence, um, and I know that my previous club coach, Clarissa, um, she knows them all very well. We've had a few Team Express alum here um, playing for him as well, and they all love him, speak very highly, and so I was confident and comfortable with my decision on being here and I knew I wasn't going to make a mistake um, and I think that's where I you know decided against everybody else is that there's a lot of familiarity here and you know it's back to Big 12 play I get to go home for some games so it was just a good choice. Right, right. How's, how's the lead coming along? Oh it's ready for some action yeah I'm really excited for it um, it's like it's been a very long time uh, but it's it's feeling a lot better it's you know, got a little sleeve on, so you know, it's, it's pretty strong. When did that first happen? Mm, uh, this same month. Uh, it was last year. I got surgery on October 8th. Um, I did it the week before wish, uh, official practices. It's like on a Monday. So, yeah, I did that non contact. Uh, we just, I was just going to catch a ball to do a layup. You know how that goes. ACL type of thing. Yeah, ACL um, reconstruction. Describe yourself as a player. Are you more? Are you more back to the basket type of player? Um, or how do you like to play? Ooh, I guess. However, you know, defense gets me. But definitely, obviously, not back to the basket. If you look at me, but I do got some moves. Um, but I'm more face up. Um, I like to drive a lot. Or just basically get like you know, take what you give me kind of player. I can do it all, I think. Yeah. Now you went on the overseas trip and did not play, right? right. I was not ready yet. Right. But that's okay because now I am. <laughs> how, how did that help you as far as learning your teammates, seeing them out there and how they play? Uh, well, that definitely helps for chemistry-wise. But, I mean, I also got to practice some of the practices here. So I got to jump in and feel for them a little bit. But I think I got to see exactly how Coach Carey coaches in a game situation, which is always different. Um, and I got to see, you know, how the young freshmen, since there's so many of them, how they do, uh, you know, against competition other than your teammates. So I got some mental notes. Yeah, yeah. Do you have any feel yet you know, for how this team is going to be? I don't, have you had your close scrimmage yet? No, not yet. Uh, but I, I don't know. I, I'm pretty confident in this. Um, you know, obviously, we're not ranked the top in preseason rankings, but I think we'll shock a lot of people. Um, the girls are picking things up really fast, um, faster than I've seen people pick up, especially since there's so many freshmen. But I think we'll be really solid on defense. I think the, we have a lot of scoring potential as well. So I think you know, we'll be a great turnaround from last year. Do you consider like the four is your natural position or what is Yes, that's what I played uh, all of my life basically, um, but I have played some three. Um, I just kind of think of myself as a utility player. So. Yeah. I know they're looking for, you know, they, they need some backup center help as well because you play in the post. Um, post, yes. I don't know if you want me as your five, but I can guard fives. Um, I like to play defense a lot, so wherever you need me is where I will go. When you started cutting on your knee, how long did it take you before you felt fully confident in it? Or are you not quite yet full? Um, well, let's see. I got here in June, um, and I had been doing some basketball stuff on my own, obviously. Um, but 
when I did get here and I started doing stuff with Sam, my trainer, it was definitely a lot different doing it as a, at a full speed kind of cut, plant, turn thing. Um, that scared me, and it scared me for probably up until last month. I, um, I was not comfortable with falling. I didn't want anybody to touch me or anybody around my knee. Uh, that's just because obviously I've been injured a few other times before. So I didn't want uh, pain results. But after I fell the first time and after you know I started cutting without um, knee brace, I felt a lot better. Uh, but now I think I'm fully confident in myself. I'll talk to you about playing the uh, Big Toe Tournament at OKC. Oh, I understand really you. I understand you know somebody. <laughs> hmm. Yes, I'm really excited. I think all of my family will finally get to go. Um, there's no excuse why Andre cannot make it or You'll why my parents can't. <laughs> okay, except for that. But everybody else can come, which will be exciting because uh, obviously a lot of they haven't seen a lot of my games, so really pumped. Did you know the tournament was played there before you decided to play? I did. To my, uh, yeah, I, I try to keep up with uh, a lot of the conferences when I was at Colorado. Even I, I didn't want to leave initially, but I kept up just for basketball sake. How's he like playing for Billy Donovan? Well, so far he likes it, actually. I mean, they all like it. I mean, he's a great person, so I've heard. Um, and I guess he's a better coach. So. Great college coach. You see I've, I've heard, heard a lot NBA. of... He's been good so far. I mean, he, they had a few preseason games, and they seem to be uh, dominating the court, so he's working out good. Were you pretty competitive with your siblings growing up with basketball? Or yes. Um, obviously, we were all athletes, so we are all very, uh, we all really wanted to win all the time. Even if it was just, you know, who's first to the door, or something small as that, or who's going to win in a game of one-on-one -on -one or two-on-two. -on -two. But I think that kind of shaped us for how we are today, you know, playing wise and even just in life. We want to strive for the best. Thank you. Thanks. Hey.